Ultimate Fact presents Top 15 Smart Ways to Boost Your Brain Power Before we begin, click that like button to inspire us. Moreover, subscribe to our channel and click the notification bell to be inspired by this type of ultimate fact. Each of our brains is made up of billions of nerve cells called neurons, which are constantly active even when we're asleep. And while our brain only weighs about 3 pounds, it requires 20% of our heart's output of blood to keep functioning. Our brain is such a complex organ that experts used to think we only used about 10% of it. But neurologists now believe it's possible we use all of it. However, how each area of this vital organ operates is still somewhat of a mystery. Danny Simmons, who study in neuroscience with a focus on teenage brain development at the University of Pittsburgh in Pennsylvania, says there are three major influences that affect the way our brain functions. Number one, stress levels. Everyone needs a little stress for motivation to exist, but not being able to handle your stress levels effectively will result in chronic stress, which studies have shown can cause brain damage. A new study published by neuroscientists working at the University of California, Berkeley, found that long-term stress, such as post-traumatic stress disorder, can trigger changes in brain structure and lead to mental problems such as anxiety, mood disorders, and even difficulties later in life. Number two, sleep. When your brain is sleepy, it's incapable of functioning at full capacity, and it has to work much harder to process information, especially when it comes to short-term memory recall and concentrating. A sleepy brain impairs your judgment, making you prone to risky decisions. In a study published recently in the Journal of Neuroscience, researchers concluded a single night of sleep deprivation evoked a strategy shift during risky decisions, making such that healthy human volunteers move from defending against losses to seeking increased gains. Number three, exercise. Your brain is the biggest metabolic system in your body, so it needs energy all the time. Exercising increases this energy, elevates cognitive performance, and also improves long-term memory, reasoning, attention, problem solving, and even so-called fluid intelligent tasks which require people to think abstractly. While long-term lifestyle choices are the key to developing the most productive healthy brain, here are some critical strategies you can employ when you need your brain to perform at the highest levels. Create the right environment. The first step to setting the stage for your brain to work at its optimum capacity involves creating the right environment. Doing so helps encourage the most favorable state of consciousness, according to a study published by Cornell University. While testing different office temperatures at a large insurance company in Florida, study researchers found that warmer temperatures made people happier and more alert. According to the study, when temperatures were low, 69 degrees Fahrenheit or 20 degrees Celsius, employees made 44% more mistakes than at optimal room temperatures of 77 degrees Fahrenheit or 25 degrees Celsius. As for lighting, natural sunlight or full-spectrum lighting helps your brain function at its best. In fact, researchers have found that too much artificial or dim lighting will drop your cortisol levels significantly, which means you'll be more stressed and have less ability to maintain your energy levels. You should also pay attention to the objects that surround you. Instead of keeping food out that will make you hungry or unused running shoes that will make you feel bad about your neglected fitness routine, surround yourself with objects that trigger creative responses such as books, photos, and inspirational quotes. If your environment is filled with positive triggers, you may find that ideas flow easier. Get the right level of distraction. When you need nose-down concentration, it might not sound efficient to head to a coffee shop, but studies show that the noise provided by most coffee spots give your brain the right amount of productivity boost it needs. One study published in the Journal of Consumer Research, for instance, found that a small level of distraction, in this case a coffee shop's ambient background noise of 70 decibels, was just the right formula for heightened focus and creativity. Listen to classical music. What does music do to your brain? Research says it can improve your mood by increasing dopamine production in the brain, which affects movement, emotional response, and the ability to feel happy. One study found that listening to classical music can improve visual attention and that its melody boosts creative reasoning, while rhythm enhances critical thinking. Browse cute baby pictures. Yes, you heard that correctly. 
If you're distracted, it will do a lot of good to take a break and browse through cute baby pictures of humans or animals online. A study conducted by researchers at Hiroshima University in Japan found that these images increased concentration by 44% in the study's participants. The reason? It comes down to the way you feel when looking at babies. In these instances, you're paying careful attention to the subject's physical and mental state, which in turn makes you more attentive to your own work. Allow yourself to be bored. The internet has made it so difficult to be bored that people are now afraid of being alone with their own thoughts. A study recently published in the journal Science found that people will do whatever they can to keep themselves busy, even if it's merely being wedded to their smart devices. Participants from the study said they felt unpleasant when in a room alone with their own thoughts for 6 to 15 minutes. Allowing yourself to be bored may enhance your creativity. Comedy writer Graham Linehan writes about this boredom in The Guardian. He says, I have to use all these programs that cut off the internet, force me to be bored, because being bored is an essential part of writing, and the internet has made it very hard to be bored. The creative process requires a period of boredom, of being stuck. That's actually a very comfortable period that a lot of people mistake for writer's block, but it's actually just part one of a long process. Further studies suggest that not giving yourself time alone to think impairs your ability to connect and empathize with others. Focus on one task at a time. You may be under the impression that you're capable of multitasking, but the truth is, you're basically just splitting your brain's power between each task. Researchers say that multitasking forces your brain to frantically switch from one activity to the next and doesn't allow you to concentrate on any of the tasks you're trying to tackle. Cliff Nass, a researcher at Stanford, told PBS that he was shocked to discover through his research that multitaskers are terrible at every aspect of multitasking. People who do it often are actually worse than those who don't do it at all at filtering irrelevant information. Breathe deeply. Fill your lungs, expel stale air properly, and your brain will thank you for it. It relies on oxygen to function at the highest levels and to grow new brain cells, which helps it encode information, so feed it with as much oxygen as you can. Oxygen is crucial to the brain, and it can't survive very long deprived of it. You should practice good breathing techniques and give your brain as much oxygen as it needs. The brain is a complex and energetic organ, which tells your body how to function using a system of nerves. It contains billions of nerve cells or neurons, and it coordinates thought, emotion, behavior, movement, and sensation. The largest part of the brain is the cerebrum, and the outermost layer of the cerebrum is the cerebral cortex, or gray matter. The deep folds in the brain increase the surface area of gray matter, which helps process more information. Eat smart foods. If you wanna have a healthier brain, you need to include smart foods in your daily diet. What you put in your body will enter your bloodstream, flow to your brain, and affect the way you feel and think. The superfoods that help your brain function better include blueberries, salmon, avocados, eggs, caffeine, dark chocolate, yogurt, green tea, and whole grains. As important as it is to consume foods that help your brain, it's also critical to avoid foods that will slow you down and affect your focus and productivity. The foods that will sabotage your productivity include donuts, saturated fats, red meat, butter, turkey, spicy foods, fried foods, and processed foods. Laugh. The release of endorphins caused by laughter will reduce stress levels. That's great for long-range brain health. Also, laughter usually leaves you more open to brand new thoughts and ideas. Humor works in the whole brain and quickly. Laughter improves alertness, creativity, and memory. Those who study the new field of gelatology, which explores the benefits of laughter, have found that laughter lowers blood pressure, increases vascular blood flow, and oxygenation of the blood, provides a workout to the diaphragm and various other muscles, reduces certain stress hormones, increases disease and tumor killing cells, and defends against respiratory infections. Help your brain by smiling, read a few comics, or faking a chuckle or two, it's infectious. Spend time in nature. A study conducted by researchers at the University of Michigan found that taking a walk among trees and natures, as opposed to an urban environment, can improve your short-term memory by 20%. According to the study's researchers, nature, which is filled with intriguing stimuli, modestly grabs attention in a bottom-up fashion, 
allowing top-down directed attention abilities a chance to replenish. Unlike natural environments, urban environments are filled with stimulation that captures attention dramatically and additionally requires direct attention. For example, to avoid being hit by a car, making them less restorative. If you aren't able to take a walk among trees and fields, the researchers suggest looking at pictures of nature to enjoy some of the same benefits. Do math questions. The only reason people don't like math is that it requires them to use their brains. By doing math, you exercise your brain, and just like a muscle, through exercise it gets stronger and quicker. A few years ago, UNESCO declared that learning mathematics through problem-solving activities was the most efficient way for a person to develop lasting mathematical skills and one of the best ways to prepare students to meet the challenges of the future. With this in mind, we provide courses that will challenge and promote the problem-solving skills of all of our students. Meditate. Just as you exercise to expand your muscles, you can meditate to increase the size of your brain. A 2000 study conducted by researchers at Harvard University found that meditation increases the size of the brain regions that are associated with focused attention, deep thought, and memory. The study says meditation can also help alleviate anxiety, depression, fear, and anger. Write it down. Go ahead and continue crafting those to-do lists. Research shows that writing things down won't just help you remember things. The simple act also creates oxygenated blood flow to areas that can help improve memory. Writing things down will also help you remember those things more accurately. Joseph Ledoux, a neuroscientist who studies how the brain generates emotions, says that most of our long-term memory is actually rewritten in our brain, depending on the emotions we had when we last thought about that memory. In other words, the memory you had of playing with your dog as a child is just a version of the last time you thought about it. The more you write down what you're thinking, the greater you can boost the memory of what you're writing about in your brain. Stay hydrated. Our brains depend on proper hydration to function properly. Brain cells require a delicate balance between water and other elements to operate at max efficiency. So try to keep your brain replenished and drink the medically recommended amount of water every day. Take a nap. NASA found that pilots who take 25 minute naps during the day are 35% more alert and twice as focused than their non-napping colleagues. Since most people don't get an adequate amount of sleep each night, naps can help increase performance and a 90 minute nap can improve your memory by as much as 10%. Below is a breakdown of how long of a nap you need for a variety of activities, according to researchers. Take a 10 to 20 minute nap and you'll get enhanced alertness and focus for the next two hours. Take a 60 minute nap, although it may cause grogginess, it can also help improve memory and learning. Take a 90 minute nap, which is how long your brain needs to experience a full sleep cycle. You'll benefit from increased alertness, memory, learning, creativity, and performance. That is all for now. Like always, if you enjoyed it, be sure to give us a big thumbs up and leave us some love in the comment section. To keep up to date with all of our awesome videos, be sure to hit subscribe and turn your notifications on to never miss a thing. Until next time, do take good care of yourself.